me in with a quick message? Y'all already know what I'm coming to do, right? I'm coming to bring you the actual factual. I'm here to get you hip to what you hip to, or hip you on to what may be hidden. And it's some shit that's hidden that spirit wants you to know about. It could be a blessing in disguise. It could just be a blessing and you know it's coming straight from the divine realm. It ain't coming from Hades or hell. You know the opposition can't stop this blessing is what I'm hearing. Then, you know, you got some blessing blockers. And that's what I'm here for as well, to let you know who it is who's standing in and who's standing in the gap, right? Standing in the gap could be, you know, somebody who is um, helping you out of the kindness of their heart or somebody who's standing in the gap. You know what I'm saying? Somebody else needs to fill that void and it's not that person. You hear me? So I want to say I love y'all. Ain't nothing but love here. You hear me? Ain't nothing but love here. Um, I ain't perfect. You ain't perfect. They ain't perfect. You know, we all are a work in progress, period, point blank. Some people change, and then, you know, most times a leopard don't change their spots or Ethiopia in their color. So we got to keep that in mind. A close friend of mine yesterday, he had something written on his wall on the lines of we all um, are on the same frequency. So let's be mindful of the type of energy we put out. I'm looking at some old photos of him, you know, from the 80s and the 90s, and I'm laughing, and I saw that, and I stopped laughing. He was like, what? I said, you know, that's not true, right? He's like, it is. He's like, that's why you're here right now, because we're riding the same wavelength. I was like, you know what? You're right. I said, you're right. And I had to, that that kind of like, it wasn't a, a, a tempting desire for me to, um, stay in his presence and it's somebody that I got love for, right? It's somebody that I got love for, but I didn't want to stay in his presence with that thought in my mind for some reason. Um, it was captivating for real because, you know, he had he he had this distinctive glare in his eyes like, yeah, and we're both Tauruses, okay? We're both Tauruses. We both went through some harsh, I'm talking about, harsh lessons in life that, you know, made us sit down a little bit, made us pay attention to, you know, the spiritual realm because we, we both were like that close. So scientists said, you know what I'm saying? So the doctors said, so the world said we were that close. You that close, you that close, you that close to that blessing, the death angel, right? Some stupid, some stupid piece of, Manure been projecting evil, not negativity, but evil. They said monitoring spirits. They don't want you to catch this blessing. So the word, the word, the gospel, the word, the word is everywhere you go. There's one phrase, a one word phrase and the gospel. The gospel is what the G's is saying. Cat does not have spirit tongue. You know that that um that um expression. Cat does not have spirit's tongue. These people talking about everything that's been on your mind, everything that's been blocking you, but it's not just with this one group of family members, not with this one friend, but it's everything. Even people, you know, you walking by or you, you might be in a store. You might just, you know, talk up on a talk up on something with somebody. And it's the same conversation. God is trying to tell you something. Yeah. Trying to lead you. Trying to lead you. I said trying to lead you. Trying to lead you. Trying to lead you. What's today, y'all? The day. What's today, y'all? Today is the day that the Lord has made. Let's rejoice and be glad in it. Regardless of what happened yesterday or last week, we got, we opened our eyes today. You know what I'm saying? He granted us that gift. He granted us that gift. You know, so we got to keep it real with ourselves. It's something about what it is that you're supposed to be sharing with somebody too, and it's the truth. You're supposed to be sharing with somebody the truth is what I'm hearing. Because whoever this person is, they, they are lying. The truth ain't in them. You know, and they had they they find it hard to um to be real, to be authentic. You know, this person, you know, they they embellish a lot just to make themselves, you know, seem bigger than life. You know, they have these 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 sayings is what I'm hearing. They have these sayings. 
They have this on slang, their own slang. This is somebody too, I'm hearing who, um, this person wants to like mentor or coach you. You know what I'm saying? Whenever you're conversing with them about something, y'all chopping it about something. You know what I'm saying? This person always got the same thing that's going on with them. And you could be thinking like, I mean, everything I go through, you go through. Y'all got some spiritual attacks. You know what I'm saying? It is some warfare. We go through that every day though, right? But whoever this person is, I'm, I'm hearing that, you know, they're mimicking something. They're mimicking something. They're, they're imitating. It's an imitation of life. It's an imitation of life, right? Um, about your, your stamina, your drive and how you get out here and get it done. You know what I'm saying? It's something about the way you drive. It's something about where you drive and it's something about your route. It's something about people, places, and things. You know what I'm saying? It's something about people, places, and things. Tomorrow, tomorrow, Hebrews 13, 13. Let's see. But I know that's trusting in the universe, right? And it's very important for you to do that. Switch some shit up. Reproach is what the Jesus hand. Reproach. Hebrews 13, 13. Let's see. So, what is it that you've been hearing, right? What it is, what, what it is that you've been hearing? What it is, the Jesus hand. You know, what it is. Is it a prayer? Is it is it what you are you obeying God? Is what I'm seeing. Are you being judged? Are you repenting? Are you thinking about eternal life? Are you thinking about eternal damnation? You know, people speaking in tongues and really can't speak in tongues is what I'm hearing. And, you know, they don't have the Holy Spirit in them. You know, and I was thinking, I said word and I said church. I don't know where it's going, though, but, you know, yeah. I said word and I said church. I don't know where it's going, but you might not be getting fed properly at your church is what I'm hearing. You know, whoever this person is, your pastor, you know, they, they are a babe in the spirit. Hebrews 13, 13. Let's see. I'm going to read it to you. Wait a minute. Oh, there we go. Hebrews 13, 13. I'm mistaken. Only, it's only 13 chapters. Yep. Yeah. Only 13 chapters in Hebrews. I like the letter of James. Hebrews 13 talks about brotherly love, not neglecting and showing hospitality to strangers and, you know, being aware that you never know when you entertain an angel, right? Remembering those who locked up are prisoners of war. Like we in prison with them. Don't mistreat nobody. Since you also are in the body, let marriage be held in honor and let the marriage bed be undefiled or God will judge the sexual and moral and adulterous behaviors. Keep your life free from love of money. The Lord is your helper. Most high God is your helper. So you don't need to fear. Remembering your leaders, those who spoke the word, right? Right. Who are these leaders that's, 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 that's spiritually advising you? You hear me? Who are they? Is what the Jesus is saying. So we can confidently say the Lord is my helper. I would not fear. But let's see. A lot, you know, a lot of us are suffering. You hear me? That's what I heard. A lot of us are suffering. Hebrews 13, 13. And I need to write it here, but I know it talks a lot about reproach and stand positive, Right. Therefore, let us go to him outside the camp and bear reproach he endured. Brotherly love. Brotherly love. 13, 13. 13, 13. I have to really, you know, it's what has been subsiding in you in Trusting yourself too, that you are this calm, that you are this new person. You hear me? I heard something about hyssop. You are this calm. You are this new person. And don't let nobody tell you and bring up, you know, those negative experiences and that fuck girl, fuck boy, karmic ass old you. That's not you anymore. You know, when those people who bring up the old you, 
or those people who want you back on a shit brick road. Though you know, that's about that energy and shit. You know what I'm saying? And something to marvel that the universe been preparing you for. And it is it's really important. And it's like, you know, I'm hearing your third eye. Third eye contact, baby. Third eye contact, baby. Stay calm. It's a tri triangular effect, is what the G's are saying. It's a triangular effect. Hmm. I also heard socket to me. Socket to me. Make me think of cake. Socket to me cake. Happy cake day, Leos. It's still your season. tomorrow we're gonna see what they gotta say but I, I you know i'm feeling like it is something that you need to know that you felt as though was going to be like a instead of like a triangle like it was gonna be a ring like a circle of love could be a ring that's influencing how you feel or something it's a ring of fire though did you receive this from most high is what i'm hearing did you pray on it it got something to do with tomorrow. You might want to act up. You might want to act up. It's like you're not going to be partial, but somebody is going to halfway tell you something, halfway do something in order to get you in order to put jumper cables on you, in order to put um, emotionally charge you, look, go on and protect yourself spiritually. Let's go on and take some spiritual baths tonight, boo. Let's take them soon as we get up in the morning. Let's, you know, that reproach too is you coming up out of this karmic energy, this low vibing energy. You hear me? Through praying and through you researching, it's something that you've been researching too. A healing affirmation, maybe. Yeah, you could put some sea salt in your mop water. You could put some Himalayan salt in your mop, your mop water. I started to do it early. I took a spiritual bath for like three days straight. I didn't take one today. I hopped in the shower. We're going to see what the G's want you to know, okay? That was the first part of it. This is the second part. Let's see what's good. Thanks for tapping in, y'all. Get a video a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't. Share with like-minded individuals. Some people don't like that I can see. You hear me? Some people don't like that I'm tapped in, so make sure you're sharing it with the right people. You hear me? I'm for real, y'all. I am so for real. Tomorrow? <laughs> Sex. 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 Part-time sucker is what I heard. Part-time sucker, part-time lover, part-time sucker. <laughs> part-time sucker? It, could this be someone's head doctor? Someone's head doctor? Take it, y'all. Somebody got dark hair. Real dark hair is pretty. So I heard they got some pretty dark hair. <laughs> See, she, she, part time sucker. <laughs> they not cheating on you, baby. They cheating with you. I just heard the main pleaser, the main pleaser, the main skeezer, and that's how they think of you. You hear me? That's how they think of you. Pisces, South Node, Virgo, North Node. It's something that you're going to have to see to believe, right? It is. That goes with the beginning of this message. It's something you're going to have to see to believe. And then it's like you're going to you go you're going to obey yourself. You're going to you're going you're going to be you're going to become disciplined in a lot of areas in your life once you see what spirit is that what what spirit wants you to see. It's like, you know, you're at that level of enlightenment now, you know what I'm saying? As we reach different levels, then, you know, we get different upgrades. And 
we're able to tap into different multidimensional energy, right? Somebody, you know, it's like they they play too much. They imitate like they they are part of the spiritual realm or something. They 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 imitate. They fake like they got faith in Most High. They fake like they driven, you know, by the Holy Spirit. They fake like they're not a temptress or a tempter. But it's like you desiring to act a little bit more differently. It's something about some fast talk and some actual factuals that's about to be presented to you. You hear me? Some actual factuals. They ain't cheating on you. They cheating with you. But Jesus said this is a fucked up ass situation. Because somebody thought that they was the main lie. That they were shining, but you know this person had this person shining too. This is somebody who, you know, they said, mm, listening to MJG and Eight Ball, get her something to eat. Any nigga will just to drill, baby. Because you know, a little trinkets here and there. You know, yeah, I'm paying for my time. This is a man who pays for his time. This is a woman who pays for her time. Take it how it resonates. You can have Pisces, South Node, Virgo, North Node in your birth chart, or this could be that person, baby. You know, you know, you 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 doing you doing a lot when it comes to your emotions is what I'm hearing. And this weed, you know, so this weed, you know, somebody says, you know. The weed had me too laid back. I want, you know, I'm observant, but you know, it's something that I may be missing. So somebody is, it's like, you know, they cutting back on the weed because they want to be drawn in emotionally because it's like the weed sometimes it depends is what I'm hearing. They just have them saying, I don't give a fuck. You know, this person gives a fuck. They do. They give a fuck. They gave a fuck. They give fucks. And see, 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 see that. What deity are they playing with? What what deity playing is what the Jesus is saying because they out here playing. They out here playing. But you know, you have some ascended masters who don't play. Your ascended masters are from the highest white lights. Your ascended masters include those of such as like our brother Jesus. You hear me? Our brother Jesus, Buddha. Um, um, I just heard who is Shiva? Shiva. It has something to do with the Middle East. The Middle East is what I just heard. Shiva. I have to research that. I think that's who Shiva is. Shiva has a lot of arms. Hey, but somebody got a lot of arms too. It's like they touchy touchy feely feely. Like they touchy touchy feely feely because this 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 goober or this goober slot is good. Somebody don't care that they is stepping on somebody's toes, sleeping with somebody's man or somebody's woman. They like shit, fuck it, you know. What they don't know won't hurt them. Damn, but there's some bullshit because <laughs> you never know who you dealing with. Word, the gospel, it's everywhere. It's everywhere. It's everywhere. It's everywhere. It's everywhere. So it's like the road to despair or the road of destiny. Which one? Rod? Rod. Because somebody show enough feels as though they Moses. Somebody feel like they Moses. Somebody feel like they... Moses, a serpent. They want to be God. They want to be the devil. They using, they are using all sorts of magic. You hear what I'm saying? And they trying to combine high vibrational beings with these imps and these monitoring spirits and shit, man. So somebody plays for. A major um, college football, basketball team. They can even be on, you know, on a chess club or something. 
whoever this person is, is something that's been it's, it's, it's something that's been activated in them, and this person is being controlled. This person is being controlled, and it's something that they're gonna tell you. You know, it's like the gospel. It's the word. It's something that they're gonna tell you. That's gonna be some actual factuals, and the G's want you to pay attention. Let's see. They want you to pay attention about these words that's gonna be coming out this person's mouth because it is coming from a higher source. So you could be able to differentiate this same gospel, the same conversation, the same phrase you know, on this side of town, that side of town, the radio. You hear me? So you could be able to differentiate the same phrase. That's what I'm hearing. Part-time work and sex. Cutting back on reefer. Cutting back on reefer and something going on with your closest friend, Pisces, South Node, Virgo, North Node. You know, believing is seeing to somebody cheating. Somebody cheating is all F up is what the G's are saying. Somebody know that this has been a long road to hold and they like this is some bullshit this is some bullshit it's all about sex yes sex it's all about sex just as long as you know they getting their needs met sexually so they don't care they don't care well, let's see you care this is what I heard you care Mm -hmm. You care. Like, you're not about to keep repeating these karmic lessons, right? Who was his closest friend? His closest friend is clarified by someone who is very deviant, very deceptive. Very deceptive. And you've been doubting this person, too. Been doubting whether or not they was your true blue. Been doubting whether or not this person is your true blue. I'm hearing somebody may have lost someone close to them, right? And that could bring you back together again. Bring you back around this person. Bring you back around this person is what I'm hearing. Y'all might be seeing one another soon. Kind of like pulled your energy back from this person. Pisces, South Node, Virgo, North Node. Spirit, clarify that. Ooh. Hmm. I'll take them. Let's do take them. So, it has a lot to do with this sex, y'all. It has a lot to do with this sex and somebody being very, 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 very fuck boy, fuck girlish. <laughs> I'm for real. Being very fuck girl, fuck girlish. They been fucking around with, with somebody's person since since early spring, right? They be hey. They be hopping in and out of different cars. They've been hopping in and out of different cars trying to avoid. I'm hearing a water sign. It's an air sign involved too. Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, Pisces. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. They not cheating with you. They not cheating on you, rather. They cheating with you. You don't even feel like smoking. Somebody's hair has been kissed by the sun. It's normally a dark brown. It's kind of light and different areas in their hair. See, the springtime is the beginning of this sex, sex, sex. Sex. This cheating. Somebody is being paid attention to. A little more than, you know, average. Whoever this water sign is, though, somebody needs to give it up. Somebody need to give it up because this water sign ain't about to be playing. This this water sign has turned in a karmic hat. <laughs> they turned in a karmic hat and they have been paying attention to what it is that spirit has been seeing, seeing and telling them and shit. You know what I'm saying? Now, this person is really believing 
their psychic abilities. This person is really MF and believing for real that they got to be responsible, that they got to be responsible for their capabilities and it's their spiritual capabilities. So it's like, you know, they know it's some bullshit because they seeing through some shit, right? They've been avoiding someone too because they don't like their energy. They don't, they don't like their energy. This is somebody you can't lie to. You can't lie to them. And if you do, you know, they might not say nothing. This is someone who knows some shit. This is someone who is spiritually tapped in. This is someone, this is someone who is elevating as we speak. They getting the upgrades. Let's get it. Let's get it. What else? Don't look back. No lack here. She, the G said, go. Oh my goodness. Just fucking go. Just fucking go. Just because you don't see no signs of this person cheating right now don't mean that they ain't. Don't mean that they ain't. You know what I'm saying? And then I'm hearing too is somebody who this person is cheating with and they just swear that I promise they feel like this person is not going home to their man, to their woman that they don't have no kind of, you know, sexy, fun, committed time with their person. Who got this dark brown here? Scorpio, scandalous, scandalous as fuck. I'm talking about scandalous than a motherfucker. And somebody paying attention to that shit. See, they feel like for real that this Scorpio is not a man or a woman of their word, right? This is somebody, this is somebody who likes a lot of sex too. They like a lot of sex. A lot, a lot, a lot of sex. And it's something that they started doing. Springtime could be the beginning of the spring, too. Could be the beginning of the spring. My ears just went out, y'all. They ringing so high. Aries. So, it's been a lot of talk. A lot of talk. Because somebody, you know, whoever this man or this woman is, I'm hearing, <clears throat> you don't know who they, who you're dealing with for real. You caught a glimpse of some shit. You woke up, you know, had eye boogers, you know, yawning and shit. You, you caught them. You caught them. You caught them. They wasn't talking to themselves. That is an altar, too. That is an altar. They ain't got all them pictures there for nothing in, those, in the sage and the incense holder and pictures and some other little emblems on there and crystals. This person is faking like they are high vibrational and that they are committed to a spiritual journey. But they are committed to a spiritual journey. But which one, God damn it? Which one, sucker? Which one? Huh? Which one? Which one? They went on vacation somewhere too with a closest friend. Is it your friend or they friend? It's both y'all. Okay, you prayed on it. Right? You prayed on it. You did. You prayed on it. And it's like, what I'm going to do, Most High? What I'm going to do? Ask for his help. It's like a nourishment, is what I'm hearing. Something nourish, something. This feel good factor, somebody who I just heard, somebody who likes to have a lot of sex, right? This is somebody who, um, man, they probably still got the swimmers from the last man or the juices from the last woman. You hear me? I'm for real. I am not for real. I am not for real when I say. That it's going to be a good thing for you to take action towards this person. You've been avoiding this person because you it's something that you fear. And it's your security. It's, it's, it's your health is what I'm hearing. It's your, it's your health. It's your, it's your goddamn sanity. You know? It's your sanity. But whoever this closest friend is, they... Hits. And it is some bullshit. They trying to put you, they trying to throw you, they trying to throw you back in time and shit. They want you to be thinking 
like you did when you was a um a a, a child when you was a teen. Yeah, they want you to think like them. They want you to think like they want you to be like this deity. They do. They want you to be evil so bad. Evil. <laughs> they want you to be evil so bad. This is the home. This has a lot to do, I'm hearing, with this help. Somebody helping you. Somebody helping somebody, you know. Like I say, any any nigga will just a drill, baby. Pimp hard. Pimp hard. Go listen to it. Pimp hard. That is, hey, go listen to it. Go listen to it. The reason why you happy, you, you not happy. You know what I'm saying? It's because this motherfucker is playing with these dark ass energies. And it's your higher self, your spiritual team. You know what I'm saying? They shielded you from a lot. You know what I'm saying? And then it's like, you know, you had to pay some karmic debt is what I'm hearing. You had to pay some karmic debt. Some of your karmic debt is paid. You know what I'm saying? And it's about how, you know, this brotherly love, how we treat others, how we treat others. It's, it's like this person, you could look at them like they a snack or treat or something. Uh, that could be for you. They could look at you like that. You know what I'm saying? This is how they get you, though. They man, all fucking <laughs> <laughs> all day long, right? It's like come them, come up from there. For one, can you breathe? Can you breathe? I mean, it's like you're not happy in this home. It's like you're not happy on this home, on, on this home, and on this. On the territory of this home. It's like, you know, you territorial too. And you seeing that, you know, it's not your territory. It's like you seeing it's not your territory. You need to see this is not your territory. Because people don't take kindly to they, they spouses and their girlfriends and boyfriends cheating and shit. And somebody know that they are fucking with a, a chronic cheater. That this person, you know, that's all they do is go and run up and tell or hop on some goober and shit. You know what I'm saying? But it's going to be the fact that they cheating with you. That they cheating with you. Yeah, look, they always backtracking. This is some shit that they always do. They always doing this shit. You know what I'm saying? Whoever this Aries is, or it could be a Scorpio, they enemy mind like a motherfucker. You intuitively aware of it too. Pisces, South Node, Virgo, North Node. It's 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 really about your capabilities too. Your capabilities when it comes to your fight, your fight, and with your almighty, your almighty self is what I just heard. Your almighty self. I am listening in my head to a song that somebody made. Somebody is like Desperate Housewives of Atlanta. <laughs> you might be in the South. But somebody desperado, they they are. They've been going back and forth to um, spiritualists and this person, you know, tapped into their spiritual capabilities too. But like I said, this person is dark. But then you, baby, you, you were dark. You were. Shake the rest of the, shake that residual bullshit up off of you. You got to take a spiritual bath. Research that. I'm going to tell you what I put in my I put Himalayan salt. I put cinnamon and I put some sugar in there and some, some herbs and stuff. I put my crystals in there. I light my candle. Yes, baby. Go on and dip down in that spiritual bath and get that spiritual protection. Open up your Bible. Go to that verse. Go to that phrase you keep hearing. It's an affirmation too that you got. It's an affirmation that you got as well. Let's see. See, somebody don't want you to follow your intuition neither. Somebody don't want you to follow your intuition. They don't want you to follow the intuitive one. That's what I just heard. They don't want you to follow the intuitive one. Cutting back on this reefer though, right? They mad that you don't want to smoke. Anyway. Somebody look at you like you less than. It's just all about, you know, that come factor. That come factor. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.